Hey up murder weirdos, so something a bit uh, different in this video. One of the things I like to do quite often is uh, have a great British Bake Off and then uh, when I'm in GTA just sit watching the cartoons in there. Uh, if you don't ever done that it's uh, quite interesting, there's some really funny stuff on there. Uh, so yeah, this is just a little skit from that. Hope you enjoy it and uh, yeah if you do I'll do a few little more of these videos. Rainbow Laser Force, the upper middle class superhero team that protects your innocence any way they can. They are Talula, Sebastian Caden, Zoe, Quota, and Dirk. We don't tolerate different. We're heterosexual over yeah! Fight evil in multicolored skin, tight car off suspended. Cow! I'm happy to wait. And what does science teach us that caused the dinosaurs to go extinct, Tallulah? A giant meteor? No, not a giant meteor. Oh. Sebastian Caden? A huge flood? That's right, Sebastian. A giant flood that in fact destroyed the dinosaurs and the Romans. Now, we as a civilization face an equally devastating threat from the environment. Now, what is that threat? Quota. Uh, climate change? Correct, climate change. Ergo, a dangerous change in our moral climate that makes us stop caring about the terrible menace that will alter the future of civilization as we know it. Yes, I am talking about a football game. Now, this weekend's big game against our arch rivals, Wickenburg Canyon High. These are evil, evil people that must be stopped. Now next week we'll move on to the insect family and the important role abstinence plays in their survival. You see, family is important people and everyone in this school is like family and that's why we don't sleep with each other as incest is just icky. Mr. Hitzman, hmm? did you really mean what you said? Oh yes, crickets do talk and they love waiting for that special person to make baby crickets with in a creative and loving way. Now one day, when I've mastered my inappropriate longings, I hope to meet an understanding Mrs. Hitzman and have some little baby Hitzmans running around. We'd probably get a Manny to play with them and help out around the house a bit. Perhaps he would be a strapping German boy with brown shirt and big muscles and an enigmatic laugh that said more than words ever could. And then in summertime, he'd work topless, his Aryan sweat producing a glimmering sheen off his sizable... No, 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 about the end of the world. Oh, yes, of course, but uh, you guys are going to stop it. Observe Wickenburg Canyon High, state funded. Oh, oh my god, ew! There are some very dark things going on there in the name of so-called science. In fact, our recent intel tells us they are harvesting souls. No! That's right, millions of little souls called stem cells. Now, team stem cells are harvested from a pregnant woman's belly button near that smelly, disgusting hole thing they have down there. Is that called a vagina? Yuck! Don't even say it! I believe the male member is much more elegant and <laughs> surprising. Why, right, one time, I was playing a game of sword fights with my elder... Sir! About saving the world? Hmm? 
Yes, yes, we have to stop them. You see, they want to build a mutant army and give people extra arms and legs so they can win at football and fondle your wives and daughters at the same time. Really? Really! Hey, where's Dirk? Hey, team! Kung Fu Rainbow Laser Force! Yeah! Uh, Dirk? Oh, yeah. Sorry I'm tardy. I'm just so full of school spirit, you know? Parvenu Hills rules! Whoa! That's okay, Dirk. You're good at sports, so we turn a collective blind eye to your remedial level reading skills. I can't of, read. I know you can't. Lack of basic manners, mistreatment of classmates, and the fact that you're 25 years old and have yet to come close to graduating. Oh, thank you, Hillary. Uh, I mean, Mr. Hitzman. Yes, I was just telling the team about some of the terrible stuff that's been going on at Wickenburg. Wickenburg can suck my nutsack, them bonus! Really? Can they? I mean, I, I mean, that won't be necessary, Dirk. Unless it would save America. Now that would be controversial. Uh, maybe we should teach the controversy, Sebastian. Mm, atheists don't like that, sir. They like to present unproven theories made up by degenerates and transsexuals wearing dresses they call lab coats as if they're facts. Just like the fact that America is God's own country and our destiny is made manifest just like the earlier settlers did when they gave smallpox to the heathens so they could meet God quicker. Very good quota. Thank you, sir. I hope to one day be elected president, but based on my ability and integrity, not some liberal agenda which loves Muslims. <gasps> what a nice, noble, kind ambition. Although I hope to high hell it never comes true. Me too, sir. I think I'll stick to basketball and making people feel uncomfortable when I talk to their daughter. I still don't have a date for the prom. <laughs> That's my boy. And I do mean boy in the most non-offensive way possible. Now, back to Wickenburg. I need you to do some reconnaissance. Listen closely. Here's what I'm thinking. Kung Fu Rainbow Laser Force! Kung Fu Laser Rainbow Force! No! Reconnaissance! Go in your school clothes and report back. Oh my god, it's like a bomb went off! I know! These people only have one home! How repulsive! I imagine some of them share toilets. The very idea of putting my bottom where someone else's bottom has been! Ew, 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 ew! Hey, knock it off! We gotta keep an eye out for the enemy! Duh, I ain't scared of them! Hand out kids and pregnant girls! They could clean my butthole! Get me? Louisa! What are you doing here? Who's she? One of our house cleaners. This is where I live. Here? This slum? This is a nice neighborhood. Besides, you only pay me $15,000 a year. Now, Louisa, shame on you O. Don't go asking for handouts. My family has worked hard for what they've got. Why don't you take the rest of the week off without pay and think about this little incident? You're terrible! Why do you say that? You should have just fired her on the spot, giving her time off she'll do what all poor people do abuse drugs and have another kid and i mean that compassionately oh my god look at that mortal sin at three o'clock ah! hey stop right there what's your problem we're heterosexual virgins and you're our problem what why don't push your luck, kid! I know how it goes. You start by holding her hands. Then it's a trip up and down the bases, fingering the tush. Then you fire off a big home run, and before you know it, you got a kid on your hands who's gonna live his whole life in prison! Yeah, spending my parents' tax dollars! We were only holding hands. I bet you smoke pot. Poor people love the pot. No, I have asthma, thank you. I bet you pleasure yourself. Sometimes, but what's that? And what's this? <gasps> pornography! Yeah, amputee pornography! That is a statue from the museum from the Renaissance. What are you talking about? You fool. Museums are the worst. Subsidized dens of sin leading people astray. My father says we should stop subsidizing decadent culture and start supporting things that really matter. Like the oil industry. Uh, I think we already do that. Shut up, pervert! He wants to chop your arms off and have sexual intercourse with you. We have pledged to wait, and your indecency has just offended these lovely, impressionable girls. Yeah! I'm just a teenage boy. You're a degenerate. You're a dickhead. Say that again. We were only holding hands, but we have made out once. No! no! Look, look, I don't want a kid yet, and I have masturbated. So what? You are dickheads! Come on, 
Rainbow Laser Force! He was leading you astray! And we saved you from a life of vice. And prostitution, and picking up cigarette butts looking for a fix. If she isn't a streetwalker already! Are you? What? <laughs> Kung Fu Rainbow Laser Force! Well, we saved those kids from unnatural desires. It's true that sometimes the only way to manage teenage sex is by acts of extreme violence. Which is good, because violence is awesome. Mm-hmm. Ew, this whole place smells so yucky. Well, that's because we're near the school. Look, they're starting their spirit rally. Are you okay? Uh, I don't know. Something's wrong. My body's going through some changes. I notice. I, I have these desires, and I can't control them. Me too. Desires to kill everyone in a violent, testosterone-fueled rage. My, my voice is changing, and I can shoot laser beams out of my eyes. Look! Feel my wrath, whore! Let's get back to base. We need to regroup. Zoe, Zoe, don't make me smite you. Yes, smite me. Team, that is the spirit. It's so good to see young people motivated in a positive way. Oh my, what happened to you guys? It was horrible, Mr. Hitsman. The girls weren't wearing pants. Please, the vapors are enough to kill a man. Do you hear me, Zoe and Tallulah? You've been cursed. No! Now, gather round. I have a plan. During tomorrow night's game, you sneak into the science wing of Wickenburg High, rescue the stem cells, and set them free in the forest, saving America in the process. What's a plan? Pay no attention to that now, Dirk, for it is time for the grand finale! Barbara <laughs> Hills Academy rules! Game on, Kung Fu Laser Girls, you hosers. You think you can defeat our alternative agenda quite so easily? Well, while you're out harvesting stem cells, we shall be harvesting you. Hey, hey. <laughs> Ow. Kung Fu Rainbow Laser Boys. <laughs> yeah, it makes me laugh every time. So yeah, bit of a different video, just something to keep you entertained stuff that entertains my sick mind and uh, yeah if you liked it remember to like and subscribe i'll put some more of these up see you in the next one